The subscriptions page provides you a quick way to see and manage all your discussion subscriptions. This tutorial will explain what is on the subscription page and what the items mean. You might want to review the tutorial on understanding subscriptions. If you don't understand the structure of the discussion tool in my courses, you should review the tutorial about this subject. To get to the subscriptions page, you click on the submission review tab on the nav bar, click on discussions. Click on subscriptions. This page allows you to view your subscriptions at the forum, topic, and thread level. You can also change the default notification or change the type of notifications for each individual subscriptions. So this one page provides you a very quick and easy way to be able to see all the subscriptions that you have and be able to manage all of them. The first thing you can do is in the display. This filter allows you to see only the forum, topic, or thread level subscriptions. So for example, if I want to see all of my topic level subscriptions, I choose that item and click apply. And that will let me see only the topic level subscriptions. If I want to see the thread level subscriptions, I click on thread subscriptions only and it shows that. So this is kind of a nice way to filter the page very quickly if I have a very discussion rich course and I've been subscribed to a lot of discussions. The second area is the default notifications method. This is where you can change what the default notification will be. Click on any radio button you want to to change it. Just keep in mind that the next time you subscribe to a, 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 a discussion, it will have the new default notification. Be careful though because the notifications on the mini bar shows right up here send me an instant notification that means you get an email every single time a new post is and include in my summary activity that one means that you get a summary at the end of the day you also can change what email the it is uh, that you're that is being sent to so if you click on change your notification subscriptions this is where I can actually change the email address right here in the notifications The, the, the rest of the page, which is the best part of the page, provides you details about each subscription level that you subscribe to. So each discussion subscription that you subscribe to. The forum level subscription gives you the name of the forum that you subscribe to, how many topics and posts there are, and again you can change the notification frequency individually separate from the default notification. So I can update the individual one if I want to get more notifications on, a, on this forum level one. I can also unsubscribe to this discussion. This is why it's kind of nice here by clicking on subscribed. If I clicked on subscribed I'll get a confirmation box and if I click yes then now I am all, I've been unsubscribed from that discussion forum. The topic level ones again give you the name of the topic, tell you how many posts are in the topic, it'll provide you with the name of the forum that the topic is uh, within. You can change the notification and again subscribe. And finally at the thread level again it gives you the thread name, how many posts are in the thread, you know tells you the topic that the thread is found within and it also gives you notification frequency and again you can unsubscribe very quickly. So the whole purpose here is being able to very quickly manage, see all the subscriptions that you have, be able to uh, subscribe, unsubscribe to them very quickly, change the frequency, and kind of see kind of a little bit of the activity that's going on in there.